To add up means to put all together. Can you solve this addition? Two plus four. Six. Six. Can you solve this addition? Two plus seven. Two. Seven. Nine. Can you solve this addition? Nine plus one. Ten. Drag the cards onto the train to complete the pattern. On a clock, you can see numbers from 1 to 12 and two hands. The short hand shows the hours and the long one the minute. Addition tables Touch a number on the grid. 4 plus 4 equals 8. 7 plus 6 equals 13. 4 plus 8 equals 12. 7 plus 8 equals 15. 2 plus 2 equals 4. 6 plus 3 equals 9. 8 plus 8 equals 16. 9 plus 9 equals 18. 8 plus 8 equals 16. Subtract means to take away. Can you solve this subtraction? 4 minus 1 3 3 Can you solve this subtraction? 2 minus 1 1 Can you solve this subtraction? 10 minus 2 8 8 oh, yeah. Subtractions tables 11 minus 5 equals 6 7 minus 3 equals 4 12 minus 7 equals 5 6 minus 5 equals 1 11 minus 9 equals 2. 9 minus 1 equals 8. 3 multiplied by 3 equals 9. 
Eight multiplied by five equals forty. Five multiplied by nine equals forty. Five. Eight multiplied by five equals forty. Nine multiplied by nine equals eighty one. Two multiplied by three equals six. Circles. Drag the shapes to complete the puzzle. Circle, 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 circle. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, yeah! Shapes when you hear their names. Curvilinear triangle. Rhombus. Parallelogram. Quatrefoil. Curvilinear triangle. Quatrefoil. On a clock, you can see numbers from 1 to 12 and two hands. The short hand shows the hours and the long one the minutes. Help me to rebuild the clock. Put the numbers where they belong. Now move both hands of the clock. You'll need a screw to hold them into place. Well done! You've built a cuckoo clock. Let's play with it, and soon you'll be able to tell the time on any kind of clock or watch. Now it's time to learn how this clock works. The small red hand shows the hour. Put it on the hour that I say. Set the hour to 1 at night. Set the hour to 3 at night. Set the hour to 6 a.m. Set the hour to 4 at night. Set the hour to 5 at night. Well done! We're ready to play with the big hand. There are always two hands on a clock. The small one sews the hour, and the big one sews the minutes. Using the two hands, big and small, try to set the clock to the right time. 
Set the hour to two forty-five at night. Set the hour to four fifteen p.m. Set the hour to eight thirty in the evening. Set the hour to eight fifteen a.m. Set the hour to seven fifteen in the evening. Well done! You're doing really well with the big hand. Now we can move on to something a bit more difficult.